Hello and welcome back to Modded Minecraft. So, today, what I'm going to do is show you we actually came into a new world. Why? Because I kind of decided that changing worlds, changing um, Minecraft versions, might as well go to the newest one that um, can accommodate Forge and Forge mods. And so that would be 112, 112 112.2. And I had to give up a bunch of mods, but some of them I did have to save. And to my surprise, actually, there was one mod that I actually had to get rid of that actually came back. And that is Jurassic Craft and Fossils. Both dinosaur mods that um, go well together. Jurassic Craft actually um, ported to uh, 111 and 112, but Fossils actually stayed at 1.7. And I've been waiting for a while because I wanted it to go to 110, then I wanted to go to 111, but um, just recently it went to 112 too. And that made me a little happy. Now I'm hoping a, um, a, a bunch of other mods will follow suit. But So today I would like to just show you around the world. Um, this is Minecraft Comes Alive Village. As you can see, and oops, and I've done a few things off camera, and I've explored a little bit. Um, as you can see, there's a bunch of new structures that come along with um, a certain mod called Ancient Warfare, and we'll explore some of them later. But as you can see, this is my village. My Minecraft village is right here. Uh, or Minecraft comes alive actually. Village is right here. This is a regular village that I actually spawned close to. I think I spawned over... Oh, what is that one? I don't know that one. I've got to check that one out. Um, maybe we'll do that a little bit later. I think I spawned it around. I spawned around here. Um, then I came down here and f saw that village. So uh, let's see. Oops. Uh, I like this version actually. Okay. So all right. So this is. Ooh, I have to make waypoints, don't I? Yep. I don't have any. So let's go ahead and make a waypoint for, let's go towards this way. Oh, before I go there, um, if you remember, in my other worlds, and if you haven't seen them yet, I'll go ahead and link a card um, up in the upper right so you can actually go and check them out. But I built a church. And so with this world being one of the last ones I'll probably upgrade to, I thought, hmm, let's get our church back. So without further ado, da -da! the new church. Scoured a few designs off of... Uh, Off of search, Google search, and I found a couple of these. Um, I kind of put uh, two together, um, two designs, and I actually kind of like it. It's actually a lot better than the other church that we had. I might actually put some fences down in here, kind of like that maybe. Oh, I can't, can I? Oh, maybe here that would that look good oh that wouldn't look good there uh, 
but maybe, maybe like that. What is that? What was that? Oh, yeah. What is that? I don't know. Alright, so let's go ahead and, uh... Do I have... Yeah, I have dirt. In spots. Oh, I don't have any more. Oh, uh, I'm gonna have to make some more. But oh, isn't that nice? And I got a couple of different. Um, stone. And look at these. These are nice. I have nice little pews here. And who, lo and behold, hello, how are you? Can I bless you today? Yes, you are the light of the world. Thank you. Thank you all. Aren't you so sweet? Thank you, Pastor. Alright, so here's the inside of the church. Cathedral type, yet not really. I like it. It's actually pretty nice, I think. I never thought, um, I didn't know what to put over here. I might end up putting something there later. We'll see. But then there's also different other mod houses. This is from Immersive Engineering. And this here is from Forestry. So this is a little beehive ish world. Hi. Hi. What I wanted to do was, today I wanted to, because this village came with a, uh, what is it called? This thing. This thing. This thing. And I wanted to show you what came in it. I have Iron Halberd. Six damage. Five damage. So this one actually has more damage than an iron than a stone sword. Diamond chest plate. Some obsidian. Can make a portal later. Some twigs, Jurassic Craft record, some oak samplings. And yeah. So let's go ahead and stick this on. Boop, and boop. Not bad if I say so myself, huh? I need to get a... Well, how do I make a... What is that called? Shield. Ooh, there's a bunch of them. Ooh. How do I make these ones? Huh. Oak planks and an iron ingot. Okay. Um. I can't make these ones? Okay, well, too bad. Uh, let's go see if we can't find an iron ingot in one of these. Oh, it's getting dark. 
I need to go to a bed. Which actually is a good uh, segue to looking at this thing. This is my summer home. Look at that. It's kind of a windmill thing. Summer cottage. It actually came from um, Ancient Warfare mod as well and a bunch of uh, villagers a couple of villagers owned this or spawned in here but they has uh, they have left so now it's mine and I can sleep sweet dreams thank you all right Ooh, raw beef. They left me some good food. Huh, whoa, what is this? Oh, a place to uh, get rid of some stuff. Run, flash! Why would I need that for? Hmm. So I may have I may have to do something with this roof. Cause I think when I reloaded the mod or the world, it kinda destroyed some of this. Um so I'm gonna have to rework that somehow. Oh yeah. Raw pork chop. Is this actually is this faster than a sword? One. No, actually it's slower. Point eight attack speed, yep. So do I want one more with a slope? Ooh. That's an iron though. I don't know. What's a butterfly doing here? So I got food. I got nice, some nice food. Alright, so here's my summer cottage, as I called it. What? Yeah, see? This definitely got messed up when the world regenerated. I'll fix that off camera, but I want to show you guys some more of the world. Okay, so. Mmm, I got food, which I should eat. So off in the distance, you can see a lot more other things from Ancient Warfare, the mod Ancient Warfare. So we got ships that I can go and um, explore a little bit later. But, I did say I wanted to see, check what that one is. So we'll do that probably. I will take a bed though. I haven't found sheep yet, so I'm just going to go ahead and take one of these beds. Hey, where'd it go? Huh, staircase is well hidden. There we go. Just because I don't want to... Alright. So in the other worlds that are the other previous world 
the adventure world in 1.7. You know that I had destroyed one of my favorite buildings in Minecraft, which is the pagoda. So off in this distance here, I started the skeleton or the base of what my new pagoda is going to be. And there it is. So this is actually going to be solid wall. I don't know what I'm going to do with it yet, but solid wall, kind of just like a base. And then how you get up is you're going to go here and then this is going to start my pagoda. Oh, I forgot to put. So this pagoda is actually not going to be square. It's going to be kind of octagonal. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight, yes, octagonal. I'm gonna go about four high walls and then come in. Maybe if I could get it, it's only 10, 10 this way, so I may not be able to get it as, a, as high. But if I don't, then I'll probably end up using this large base as um, another floor if I can't get this other pagoda to get to about four. So that's the start. That's going to be a big base too, if not, but I don't know if I, because they actually need stairs to get on top of it so I don't know where I'm gonna put the doors stores on either side or something or I don't know that's gonna be for another another time so let us go and explore the area that I thought, whoa, ouch, ouch, I can't parkour. Hello, are you stuck? Are you? Mm. Get, get down, get down, there you go. And you, you can't protect the village up there. Get down. All right. That in the distance somewhere. That's a nice little river. Can put like a boat ramp or something coming off of this little area. Put a little boat ramp so we can have so I can go off in the distance here. Okay. What is this little area? I don't know. What? What do I hear? Oh, chicken. Chickens. Uh oh. Um, I don't know if I like that. Is that a friendly house or is that a... Hopefully that's a friendly house. I said I haven't seen it before. I know off in the distance to the north, um, after I had built my church, there's actually, I actually found another church. What is that? I don't think this is a friendly house. Well, let me eat. Get my energy. Maybe I should have gotten a shield. Oh, there's another ship in the distance. Whoa, 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 whoa. Someone is shooting at me. Yeah, that's not a friendly house. That is definitely not a friendly house. That is definitely something I need to... Nice, you can see my church from here. It's definitely something I need a bow and a shield and all that other good stuff to have. Whoa, there's a crocodile right there. Um... 
where should I go? Let's just go this way. That's scary. Okay. Well, as you can see, the new world's coming together quite nicely. Nice trip. What is this little area? Oh, this is the MCA world. Which I'm actually happy that this is starting to have golems here. Because I thought the golems were only going to be in the Minecraft world over here. But they're actually spawning on that area too, so that's good. Unless they all moved. Nope, we got some here. One, two, three, so... Well protected. Both areas are well protected. One of these, beetroot and carrots, yep. Potatoes. All the normal stuff. Let's see what we can find. I wanted to go here to see if we can find a iron ingots. Yes, we do. Why do I hear a zombie? Let's sleep. go and find, yep, here we go, one of all these. So it was this and this? Yes. Boop. Yay. So, there's actually more iron ingots too, weren't there? What do I need? Maybe boots? Do I have enough for boots? Are they gonna give me enough for boots? Where'd it go? I'm lost already. Over here. One, two, three. I am rod. Yep, that's enough for a boot. Yep. Okay, so I think it's like that. Get some boots. Okay, get some armor up. And what else could I find here? Why is there a zombie hit noise? Is he, is he below? Might might be below. Because I know there is a... Uh, where is it? It's on the outskirts over here. It's gonna... it's my... It's gonna be my caving area. It's somewhere over here. I forgot where it was. Getting hungry. It's somewhere over here. Oh. I think it might be in between these. Yeah, I think it is. Right here somewhere. guy. There. And they weren't treated very well. Ooh, more iron. But yeah, that's going to be my caving area. I should put a, 
Oh, that's what I should do. Let me go ahead and put, whoa, hello. All right, right here is gonna be the waypoint for caving. Uh, new. Mining zone one. And we'll put that about maybe white-ish or uh, maybe gray, gray. And then, let's make a way, hello. Oh, that's for the door. Let's make a waypoint for this right here. This is gonna be the waypoint, uh, let's make it over here. We'll just call this in the middle of everything. So let's just call this, hmm, my, let's call it Aikshudo City. It's my city. And I like blue, so I'm gonna put that blue. Yep. So Mining Zone 1 and Aikshudo City. Shiro City right there. And then once I get this area, I'll go ahead and put that. Hmm. Okay. What I wanted to do as well is when I reset the mod. Where am I going? Oh, this way. When I reset the mod, I had to reset my doggy. So let's go ahead and finish up by changing up what the dog does um, and we'll call it an episode hi hi Mosley hello so I think it's a stick right yeah all right so I have 15 points I definitely wanted to do um, doggy dash Moves faster. Uh, pack puppy. Each level gives your dog three inventory slots to open the plank. So we'll give one. Let's see what that does. And then it said planks, right? See, so this gives me, th gives him three. So each one, let's, let's do two there. So he'll give me six, which is good enough, which is good. Then, oh, let's see. I don't want that yet. No, I want him to, let's see, hunter dog. No, not yet. Uh, silverfish? No. Pillow paw. Yes, that's the one. Three or more blocks before it starts taking damage. Cause I want it to be able to jump. So. No, puppy eyes. No, I don't need that. Quick healer. Improves the rate which your dog will heal. When sitting. So one. Two for the healer. We'll do guard dog. Physical attack. One, two. Improves critical hit rate for every level plus heart when you. Um, no, no, I don't want that yet. Happy eater. No. Allows your dog set things on fire while attacking. Uh, no, I don't want that yet. Oh, let's see. Rescue dog. No. No. Shepherd up with some weight in your hand. Huh, I might want, I might like that. No. Wolf mount. Well, let's see. 
let's just go ahead and leave that for now. Um, let's just do it that way. Maybe I think you to talk so you can maybe two of that. Smell creepers and it will growl to warn you the range at which you can um, the dog will reset creeper's designation. Mastering the skill. That should be nice. That would be nice too. Okay, it will follow me, but it will not attack. I don't want it to wander. I don't want it to attack. In this mode, your dog will follow you, and if any mob draws near, they will attack it without warning. I don't want to do that because they might. But will not attack unless you use the command beam. The command? Where is my command beams? I forgot where the I put them. Let's do. Let's do that for now. Alright, so he will follow, he will end up following me. Okay. What is that? Oh, that is a... Okay, so he's a pack dog. Alright, so... See, we gave an initial skills to the dog. We showed you around the... Ashuto City. Now let me... Let him sit for now. And showed you a, f a bunch of other things that popped up because of different mods like that one there and some of the ships. So I think this is going to be a nice world. Um, 1.12.2 uh, is not the newest one um, at the time of recording. I think the newest one is uh, 1.13.2 with the... Um, one one point fourteen in the horizon. So, speaking of horizon, of course, there's other things that we ha we will be able to explore eventually. Some ruins and some. Um, there's another church over there, so we'll go check that out when we have enough. I'm gonna go mining and get some utensils, get some ore, so I can be prepared to go and explore so well that's it for this one uh thanks for watching if you like the video squash that like button if you feel that too check out any of the links in the description below subscribe if you haven't and tap on the bell to get notified of more videos until the next time remember jesus loves you so be a blessing to others and keep lighting it up